Ronnie, stop! That's my laptop! Give it back! Over my dead body! No, 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 no! Not my laptop! No! Take that, Noah! I hate you! Come on, please turn on, please! No! Oh, what? You're gonna cry now? <laughs> Ronnie, that was my key to becoming a billionaire! Billionaire? You don't even make 20 bucks! You're a loser! Dad, please, I need a ride to the electronics store! Why, so I can buy you new headphones? No, I need to fix my laptop! Why would I help you after you've been so horrible? to your brother yesterday. What are you even talking about? Get your own ride. I am so disappointed in you. You are terrible. Dad, wait. Ugh, fine, whatever. I'll just walk to the electronics store myself then. So what do you think? Can you fix it? Yeah, in your dreams. This thing is toast. This has got to be the trashiest laptop I've ever seen. Well, I did get run over by a car. It's seen better days. So why do you even want to fix this hunk of junk? Well, I can't just buy a new one and I need it for work. Well, there's no fixing this disaster. So, oh well. So really, there's nothing you can do at all? I'll offer you a couple quarters and a stick of gum for it. Come on, dude. Seriously? That's a ripoff. All right, all right, fine. I'll give you 20 bucks for it. Take it or leave it. At least the school will let me use their computers. I think it's best I invest some of this money. I hope it goes to good use. Before I know it, maybe it'll even double in return. Yeah, let's see. Oh, this one looks good. What are you doing? Wasting your money on a dumb investment? What do you want, Ronnie? Oh, nothing. I just wanted to see what the next billionaire was going to do with his $20. Oh, you think you're so smart, don't you? I'm just trying to make the right decisions. I want to be rich one day. Maybe this is the way to do it. Yeah, well, if you're really smart, you would have spent that money on a haircut because your hair looks ridiculous. No, it doesn't. Just leave me alone. You know, Noah, this is why no one likes you and everyone likes me. Oh, yeah, Ronnie? Do they? They do. I happen to be the most popular kid in school. I have way more friends than you, and even Stacy has a crush on me. None of that even matters, Ronnie. Just knock it off. Oh, yeah? And what are you gonna do about it? You're just a nobody. All right, boys, that's enough. This library is peace and quiet only. He's the one that started it. All right, Noah, you're coming with me. Seriously, why do I get detention? I didn't do anything. Because this is where you belong. Starting fights in the library, you're nothing but a rule breaker. Now you're going to stay in detention and be quiet. Ugh, great detention. Wait a second. Timmy? Hey, Timmy, what are you doing here? You're like the nicest guy in school. Well, according to the teachers, I was the one who started a food fight. Even though I was getting my head pushed into a bowl of spaghetti. Ugh, not the cafeteria spaghetti. That's nasty. Right? That's what I'm saying. They blame the whole thing on me. Oh, man, I'm really sorry. Seems to be a running theme today. Something similar happened to me. Yeah, well, what are you in for? My brother came over and started picking a fight, and then he pushed me in the library and thought I was the one that started it. Your brother was picking on you? Yeah, all because I want to be a billionaire. Oh, man, that's a huge goal. Yeah, I know. And sometimes it almost seems impossible. But I know if I believe in myself, I'm gonna make it possible. I mean, it's my dream. I have to do it, right? Well, I think so. You're a smart guy. You can make anything happen. Yeah, and then I'll prove my brother wrong. What did I say when I brought you in here? Shut up! Ugh, sorry. Sorry. That just bought you an extra 20 minutes! Ugh, I can't believe the librarian kept us that late after school. The sun's already setting. I am hungry. I wonder how my investment's doing. Let's check it out. No. No, that's impossible. A thousand dollars already? How? There's no way. Oh my gosh, this is incredible. A thousand dollars. thousand dollars? What do you mean? Let me see that. See, that's the investment you told me was stupid, Ronnie. No way is this all yours. This is fake. It's gotta be a screenshot. No, it's real. You could refresh it too. You see, I told you one day I'm gonna be a billionaire. Give me my phone back. I don't think so. Oops. What is wrong with you? Oh, well, so much for that thousand dollars. Ronnie, that's not how money or an investment or even the internet in general works. You just broke my phone, that's all. Yeah, well, shut up. You should give me some of that $1,000 so I can have my investment. No, Ronnie, that's my money. I'm not just going to give it to you. Fine, then. If you're not going to give it to me, then I'll just find my own way to take it. What is going on here? Everything's destroyed. Take this and this. What is he doing? Ronnie, knock it off. Oh, and you. Oh, hey. What in the world are you doing? What am I doing? More like, what are you doing? Here, take this. This. Ronnie, you are acting insane. Destroying our home? Seriously? Hey, boys, I'm... Huh? Huh? What on earth did you do? Dad? No, it just started running around the house, smashing everything and screaming at me. What? Dad, that is not true. Look at this mess. You broke everything, Noah. Well, it looks like you turned the house into a reflection of yourself. Yeah, 
Kyle will know it still has a thousand dollars so he can pay for everything he's just broke. What? A thousand dollars? No, is that true? How did you get that money? I'm sure that he stole it or something. Ronnie, cut it out. I did it. You probably did steal it. That's enough out of you. You've got a thousand dollars. You're gonna give me that money. To fix what you've done. That's it. I'm done with this place. I've had enough. There's no way I'm giving Ronnie my money. If I stay around here, he's definitely gonna steal it. No one believes in me anyways. None of my family likes me. My dad doesn't believe in me. If I just sneak away now, they're probably not even gonna notice. I'm just gonna start my new life. I'm gonna prove them wrong. Oh, but I have nowhere to go. Maybe I have an idea. Hey man, I got your text. What are you doing? Hey, is it alright if I crash at your place for a while? What? What's going on? I I just can't live at home anymore, and I've got nowhere else to go. You were the first person I thought of. Eesh, I'm sorry, man. I don't think there's going to be any way my parents let that slide. The world is purple, guys. You all need to listen to me. The world is purple. Roblox is over. Where, where is my home? Where's my home? Please, Timmy, I'm begging you. My entire family hates me. I've got nowhere else to go. I can't stay out here on the streets. Mm, all right, fine. Come on, I'll sneak you. Oh, you are the best. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I really appreciate you helping me out, man. This means a lot. Yeah, of course. No sweat. I wonder how my investment's doing. Can't really check it on my phone. My screen is broken. Oh, if you want it, you can check it on my computer. It's right over there. Password's just a slide cheese. The slide cheese. Really? Yeah, what? Who made you the password police? It's a good password. All right, let me just sign in. Whoa, Timmy, this is crazy. I have $10,000. You've what? I know you can make money like that. Yeah, I didn't either. I knew if I invested some of my money, it would grow, but not this fast. I need to take this and invest it in other things. Yo, dude, your phone's ringing. Oh, I can't see who it is. Hello? Who is this? What? Who is this? This is your father. Where are you? Look, I'm sorry, Dad, but I'm not coming back, okay? I'm not coming back. Whatever. I don't care. Your brother broke his leg riding a dirt bike. <sighs> Seriously? Yes, and he's in the hospital. You need to be here right now. <sighs> well, I guess I have to go check up on my brother. Oh, where could my dad be? Oh, there he is. Sorry, sir. That's the price of the bill. I can't negotiate it with you. There's no way I can afford this. There's no way anybody could afford this. He just broke his leg. How is it this expensive? Well, maybe if your son was more careful while riding a dirt bike, this wouldn't have happened in the first place. I can't believe this. Spend the money on the dirt bike and spend the money on the broken leg. Uh, how am I going to afford this? Dad, don't worry. I'll take care of it. What? No, I, no. What? You're just a stupid kid. There's no way you have that kind of money. Okay, seriously, you don't know me at all. I do have that kind of money, and I just want my brother to be okay. But right, if you got the money, we'll let you pay for it. How on earth could you get that kind of money? What are you doing, stealing now? No, it's not stolen, Dad. You just should have believed in me. Uh, I get with this dumb billionaire thing. Yes, and obviously, it's working. It doesn't seem like you care. No one does. Yeah, well, thanks for helping out. Now you're doing this whole running away, living alone thing. But if you want, you're welcome back anytime. Whoa. Okay, thanks, Dad. Maybe I will go back. I hope Ronnie's leg's okay. It's been like a month or so since it happened. He said he'd come pick me up. Can he actually drive? Where is he? <sighs> there he is. Are you ready or not? I have a party to go to. Yeah, no, I'm ready. Thanks for giving me a ride. This is a really important meeting. Yeah, whatever. Now we're even for the whole leg thing. Well, I did that because you're my brother. Shut up. Now here you are. Get along. All right, thanks, Ronnie. Whatever. All right, that must be him. Noah, you've got this. You got this. Uh, excuse me, you're the real estate man, aren't you? Hi, my name's Noah. Uh, hello. Uh, I thought I was meeting someone that wanted to buy the building. Yeah, that's me. I want to buy it. What, you're like 15. You can't be serious. I am serious, and I have the money for it. I want to buy this building, and I'm going to start a business with it. Well, this is kind of unheard of. But if you got the money, we can talk. Trust me, I've got it. Just from looking at this place, I know this is the one. Oh, man, that thing drives so fast. I can't believe it's only been three years since I started investing. And now I'm really successful. I was able to buy my dream car. You're out of the way, loser. You're in my spot. Ronnie, calm down. Watch where you're going. Why should I watch where I'm going? Why don't you watch where you're parking? All I did was park in the driveway. And you just hit my car. Yeah, whatever. I think I care. Well, you should care. I spent a lot of money on it. Ronnie, where are you going? Get back here. Ugh, he's impossible. Well, we made enough money. You can get your car fixed. Thought your brother, though? I don't know. I think you need to help him out. What? Me help him? Yeah, it seems like your brother's going through a pretty tough time. He's not really hanging out with his friends. He seems to be alone. Why is that my problem? Because he's your brother, that's why. Why don't you help him get a job? <sighs> Fine. Fine, I'll help him get a job. I'm late to a really important meeting. Hey, it's you again. I can't believe you still work here. Yeah, what do you want? I'm really busy. Oh, well, I'm actually here to buy the building. You what? No, 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 you can't do this. Th this is my life. I breathe computers. Well, your business is failing, and the building is for sale, so I'm 
I'm buying it. Plus, you rip people off all the time. You never help anyone. So I'm going to make this into something more. Well, okay. I, I know the business is failing, but there's not much I can do. Well, you could try being nice to people. That's usually a good start. Well, look. Okay, I'm, I'm sorry I was a jerk. All that stuff was in the past. Please, you have to give me a chance. Please. Oh, look. If you promise to work hard and actually be nice and helpful to people, I guess it would be fine if you work for me. Oh, thank you so much. You're not going to regret this. I promise. Yeah, well, I hope not. As of now, I'm your new boss. What I say goes around here, and you're under my watch. If I see you be rude to one customer... Well, don't you worry. The old Clarence is gone. This is the new Clarence. Well, good. Just so you know, Clarence, we're going to have a new employee starting here real soon. Woo, that car is pretty. Wait, no way. Well, I can see that you're enjoying your dad's money. What? Look at this car. There's no way you could afford this. Um, actually, I can't afford this. I earned this with my own money. Ha 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 ha! Yeah, right. You're just a spoiled little brat. That's not true. You don't know me at all. Just leave me alone. I'm a librarian. Do you have any idea what I have to go through every single day? You don't deserve this car. I do. Why? Just because you're a librarian? Yeah, and I deal with you stupid kids all the time. You're as dumb as a streetlight. What does that even mean? I don't know. It just sounded good. You can drive around in this fancy car all you want. You're going to be nothing but a loser. I'm going to be a billionaire. Just wait and see. <laughs> a billionaire? Yeah, right. No one in this town becomes a billionaire. That's for sure. Oh, yeah? Well, then watch and learn, because I'm going to be the first one then. Yeah, yeah. I'll be waiting to see you crash and burn. Go enjoy some more of your dad's money, you spoiled brat. Ugh, you're a mean, mean man. Ugh. No one, this is a waste of time. What are we doing here? Well, I just bought this electronic store, and this is my new business, and I'm giving you a job. What? I don't need a job. Uh, yes, you do. Plus, I promised dad I would help you out. Well, let's make one thing clear here. I don't do jobs. That's not me. What are you even talking about? How are you gonna move forward in your life without any kind of goal, or job, or money? You already know my plan. I'm gonna be a big, famous football star. I'm just waiting for a coach to pick me up. And in the meantime, why don't you just get a job? That way you can make your own money. Come on, just come in and check it out, okay? Ugh. All right, fine. Whatever. If it'll get you to shut up. Don't you see? It's not that bad. Yeah, I guess it's all right. Computers aren't pretty sick. See? And I know you know a lot about computers. You would do great at this job. Why don't you just give it a shot? Yeah, whatever. Fine. Am I the manager or what? Uh, we'll start you off as a sales associate at first, and then maybe you'll become the manager one day. So what do you say? Are you in or what? Yeah, yeah, I'll do it. All right, awesome. I could really use your help on this. It means a lot. Good luck, Ronnie. I know you'll do good at this. Hey, Timmy, man, it's so good to see you. I feel like I've been so busy lately, we haven't caught up. I can't believe how far you've came, man. This is incredible. I know. Just a couple years ago, I was a completely different person. Now, this is just the beginning. Are you ready for this real estate meeting or what? I'm as ready as ever. <laughs> awesome. I cannot wait to have you be a part of this. Come on, the real estate agents waited and then cancel my four o'clock and tell that guy he's a loser and i'll never do a business with him again hold on my friend's coming hey noah good to see you buddy hey man nice to see you too i want to talk to you about this place i mean it is a little bit on the pricey side but i know you've got the money yeah i was looking at the paperwork there's no way this place costs that much trust me it's true this is the top of the top come on i know you're always looking for the next business deal looking to make more money so so am I. This will help me get rich. I mean, make us rich. Bro, oh, I don't know. I got a bad feeling about this. Yeah, you know what? I think you might be right. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Come on, come on. What are you talking about? This is going to be great. Please don't back out on this deal. If I didn't know any better, I'd say you're trying to take advantage of me. You're trying to sell me this dump so that you can make more money. What? <laughs> no, no, I would, I would never do something like that. Look, man, I'm not taking the deal. Me and my friend, we're out of here. Come on, Timmy, let's go. Wait, wait, wait. Come back. Oh. Man, there goes my commission. Well, this is it to me. The grand opening of the food bank. I have to say, I think it's going pretty well. Dude, this is amazing. You would afford all this stuff? Yeah, I saved up about a half a million dollars, and now I want to help people out. I know there are tons of people around here that deserve it. Yeah, man, there are. I mean, look, there's already people lining up at the door. This is going to make a big difference. I'm just glad that a lot of this hard-earned money is going to go help people in need. Wait a second. What? Ronnie? Ronnie, what are you doing here? Ugh. 
It was so boring at the store. I needed a break. I just wanted to come see what this place was. Ronnie, you're supposed to be working at the electronics store. You can't just leave your job just because you want to. Mm, mm, you just give this out to people? Mm. Yeah, we give it out to people that actually need it. Now put that down. Mm, all right, all right, all right. Chill, chill, fine. No, Ronnie, I've had enough of this. You need to stop acting ridiculous. What? I'm not acting ridiculous, but fine. I guess I'll go since I know I'm not wanted here. Ronnie, that's not what I meant. It's just... Uh... Don't worry. I know exactly what you meant. Take this. Ugh. Ronnie, are you kidding? Ugh. Ugh, stupid Noah and his stupid money. Ooh, look at me. I'm so rich. I have so much. Ugh, I can't stand him. You know, all that money is just getting to his head. You know, I don't even know why I took this stupid job. I don't need it. I don't need anything from Noah. I'm going to show him just how much I don't need anything. I'm going to quit. And you know what? I think before I do, I'm going to teach him a lesson. That's way better. Dude, that was so not cool. Yeah, well, enjoy working at this useless store, loser. Uh, this better not be true. Oh, no, no, look at this place. Clarence, when you called, I didn't think you were actually serious. Yeah, your monster of a brother did all this. Uh, I knew I shouldn't have hired him. It's only a matter of time before he did something immature and stupid. I'm gonna go have a talk with him right now. What am I gonna do about all this stuff? See if there's anything you can fix. I'll be back to help you in just a bit. Ronnie, Ronnie, are you home? Yeah, what's up, man? What's up? Are you joking me right now? What is your problem? You threw one of your temper tantrums and destroyed everything at the store. And what about it? You deserved it. I deserved it? No. No one deserved it. You're just acting out like a child. I'm trying to make something out of myself. I'm like you. Whoa, whoa. Hey, Noah. That was uncalled for. Dad, you cannot be serious. You're taking Ronnie's side over this? He destroyed the entire electronics store. Look, sometimes brothers fight. You can't control it, okay? Just leave your brother alone. Leave him alone? No. What? That's it. I'm done. I don't need you. You, and I don't need you. I don't need anybody. I am so sick of this. Where are you going? Noah, come back here. <laughs> Later, loser. Whoa, I still can't get over how awesome this place is. I mean, leaving home the way I did probably wasn't the best, but I had to get out of there. At least now, Timmy and I can just do our own thing. And I'm going to be graduating soon. This is exactly what I needed. Whoa, dude. I know you showed me the pictures, but this place looks even better in person. I know, man. Looks like we're really living the dream, you know? No? Now we're not going to have any distractions from my annoying brother or my inconsiderate dad or anybody else. We are one step away from becoming billionaires. Don't forget, too, we're graduating in a week. Ah. <sighs> No more school and the rest of our lives ahead of us. I know it sounds beautiful. I cannot wait, but I've actually been thinking and I kind of have a new idea. Oh boy. Another one of your crazy ideas, huh? All right, well, what is it this time? Well, thinking about graduating, I actually have an idea to give back to the school. Well, as most of you know, my name is Noah and I'm going to be graduating soon. So as my graduation gift, I want to give the school a million dollars. But gosh, a million dollars? This is amazing. The greatest gift we've been given so far. Well, I'm just glad to help, Principal Waddles. Because of your generous donation, we want to name our library after you. We'll even paint your name on it. Wow, thank you. That actually would be really cool. Having a building named after me? I never saw that coming. This is ridiculous. You're giving him a library? What about me? Ew, who is that guy? Uh, this is so stupid. I should have something named after me. Why don't you name the football field after me? Ronnie, you're causing a scene and making a fool of yourself. Just go home. You know what? I will go home. This whole place sucks. You suck. I'm going home. I still can't believe I'm doing this. I mean, I'm gonna go have dinner with Dad and Ronnie. Been a long time. Hey, Dad. Hi, Ronnie. There he is. Noah, gotta say, I am so proud of you. Getting a whole building named after you at your school? Come on. Only successful people have that. Yeah, thanks, Dad. I really appreciate it. It's kind of cool. Kind of doing pretty good for yourself. You know, in honor of all of your accomplishments, I decided to get you a little gift. Gift. Wait, really? You got me a gift? Yeah, I mean, you remember when we were younger and I destroyed your laptop all those years ago? Yeah, I remember. Did you get me a new laptop? Oh, well, what's this in my hand? Is it for you? Wow, thank you so much, Ronnie. I'm shocked. No, really, you don't have to thank me. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Ronnie! 
Daddy, that was my laptop. Yeah, well, not anymore. You see the look on his face? <laughs> really, Ronnie? You're acting like a child. Yeah, well, we finally come home after so long, and you're still just such a big shot around us. That's not true. You are the one that's acting out for no reason. Actually, you know what? I think there is a reason, and you're just not telling me. Yeah, I'm acting out like this because you're dumb. I'm dumb? Look at me, Ronnie. I think you're just jealous of me. I have a great job, and I live on my own, and you're still at home living with Dad. You know what? That's it. Get out. Boys, you need to stop this. This is getting out of hand. Calm down. No, he made this get out of hand. Get out. You are not welcome here. Yeah, that sounds great. Thank you so much. Next Friday sounds perfect. Great, I'll see you there. Well, that sounded good. What's going on? Well, that was one of the most successful businesses in Roblox, and they want to do business with us. That was just the CEO. Dude, that's insane. Do you have any idea how many people want to work with this company? If we keep this up before we know it, we're both going to be billionaires in no time. Ooh, we'll be billionaires in no time. Yeah, well, not on my watch. I can't let my little brother be more successful than I am. I'm not going to let him get away with this. I have a call to make. Man, this place is crazy. Hey, Jeremy. Ronnie. Hey, it's great to see you. Man, it's been so long. I mean, what? I've seen you since school? I know. How have things been since then? Uh, I mean, I'll be honest. Things aren't really going all too great for me. I mean, that's actually why I'm here. Well, hey, you need to get over the past. You got to start giving yourself a better future. And that's why you're just the person I wanted to talk to. I want to become successful on my own and for my other personal reasons. Well, listen, Ronnie, we've been best friends for years. If I'm going to do this for anyone, it's going to be you. Well, I've been looking for a job, so I was wondering if there's anything that I could pick up. Yeah, of course. We definitely have a place for you. What do you say? Yeah, I'd love to get started. Here, let me get some paperwork for you to sign. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect. Oh, my brother's going down. And here we are. This is gonna be great. Hey, loser, what are you doing here? I'm here for a very important business meeting. Ronnie, what are you doing here? I work here, dork. Hey, really? I had no idea. Good for you, man. Hopefully it'll bring you what you need in your life. Oh, it sure will. In fact, it already has. Well, that's good. Ronnie, I'm actually proud of you. I'm glad you're starting to make the right choices for yourself and for dad. Well, it was nice to see you, but I might be late for the meeting. I need to go. You better not be doing any business with this company. Ugh, I can't believe him. I'm not gonna let this slide. Thanks again for meeting with me. I'm so excited to start working with you. Yeah, likewise. Joining together is gonna make both of us a lot of money. And also give back, which is even better. I cannot let this happen. Jeremy, what are you doing? Uh, Ronnie, I'm in the middle of a business meeting here. You are acting out of line, Ronnie. Stop. No, I'm not gonna stop. Jeremy, you cannot do business with him. This is my brother. He's garbage. Look, Ronnie, this is the real world now. I'm not just gonna not do business with him because he's your brother. You're acting way out of line. I am not acting out of line. This guy thinks he's better than everyone else in this room. Jeremy, you have no idea what you're talking about. Okay, you know what? I gave you a chance and you blew it. You're fired, Ronnie. Wait, what? You heard me. You're fired. I want you out of my office now. No, but this is all your fault. Timmy, I just don't really know what to do. I don't know how to get to my brother. I'm trying so hard, but I feel like I'm not doing anything wrong. I'm also not doing anything right. I just can't get to him. Do you want my honest opinion about your brother? Yeah, of course I do. I just think he doesn't want to grow up. I mean, he kind of peaked in high school. Yeah, I think you might be right. It's like he's still back there, thinking he's the most popular person in school. He's my brother. I don't want to just, like, give up on him. No, you're right. You shouldn't. Family sticks together. But at the same time, too, there is a time and place to call it quits. Yeah, maybe you're right. Maybe it's crazy to think if I keep doing the same thing, I'll expect Ronnie to change. Whatever I've done so far obviously has not been working. Well, then it sounds to me like it's time to try something new. Yeah, maybe you're onto something. Something new. Oh, what could that be? I guess I'll have to think about it. Thanks, Timmy. You always do come up with the best ideas. Hmm, I gotta be careful. Maybe I can find something in there. Something just to help what I need. Let's see. All right, gotta be careful. Oh, the security guard here. What do I do? Hey, you! You're not supposed to be here! Ugh! Ugh! Just wait until Noah finds out about this. Ronnie? Ronnie, where are you? I know you're home. Where are you? I thought I banned you from the house. Ronnie, I have officially had enough with you. How dare you say that to me when you literally broke into my house last night? What are you talking about? I did no such thing. Yes, you did. You can't lie to me about this. I have security cameras, idiot, and also a security guard who described you perfectly. Ugh, great. You're big, fancy security. You know what, Noah? I hate you. You don't deserve 
anything that you've gotten. Oh, hey, 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 easy. It's four o'clock on a Tuesday, boys. Calm down. No, Dad, I'm sorry. I cannot calm down right now. Ronnie broke into my house and tried to rob me last night. Yeah, and I probably would have gotten away with it, too. You know what, Noah? Everything was perfectly fine until you came into the picture. Oh, my gosh, Ronnie. Stop it, okay? Just back off. Make me, loser. All right, boys. Hey, 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 cut it out right now. I'm sorry, Dad, but... I, I just can't do it anymore. I never want to see Ronnie ever again. As far as I know, my brother is dead to me. Look, Noah, you and I can talk numbers all day long, but I just got to know, are you interested in this deal or not? I've been thinking about it all week. It is a huge offer. Listen, if you take the deal, then both of our businesses can do amazing things. I know. We could change a lot of lives, change this city. I think you're right. Jeremy, you've got a deal. Awesome. Noah, you just became a whole lot richer. Yeah. Thanks. And so did you. And I think I know exactly what I'm going to do with the money. This charity event is going so well. We're raising a lot of money. This is absolutely nuts. This has to be the most you've ever donated to charity. Yeah, actually, I think you're right. It is. And hey, congratulations on the big day, Mr. Billionaire. It's in all the newspapers. I mean, it took a while, but... I told you, if you worked hard, you would make your dream come true. Dream come true? This guy's a fraud! My brother is an absolute jerk. He doesn't plan to use any of his money for good. He's literally donating to charity, you idiot! Ronnie, that's not how donating money works. You actually have to do it. Uh, no one understands me! Ronnie, I tried to understand you, but sometimes you can only do so much for someone. It's time you learn to change things for yourself.